I'm still a boy. I'm not a man yet. I just say I'm a man, but I'm a boy. Welcome back to my channel. And before we do this, you have to show you can't just walk into the screen. <laughs> Welcome back to my channel. So I'm standing here with my brother and we are gonna do the credit card challenge. Now before this boy knocks in <laughs> before this boy knocks his head into the wardrobe, I'm gonna need you to subscribe to my channel and join the revolution, okay? We're gonna give you a minute to do just that. 20 minutes later. Okay guys, so basically if he can catch this with his head, I'm gonna slide it down the wardrobe here. And if he can catch it with his head, I'll buy him anything that he wants. Okay? You ready? Can you do this, bruv? Yep. Look, at, look at the camera, yeah? Can you do this, bruv? Yep. You got this, mate. Yep. You got your, what do you want? Hmm? What do you want? I'm gonna buy 12 carat diamond earrings. Probably just gonna be buy some shoes. Shoes are expensive, my boy. You know what the trick is? The science to this thing is you gotta hit it hard, yeah? You gotta like BAM! Yo, I'm coming with this. And I oh You gotta hit hard. You gotta like just smash your head there, innit? Mm. You gotta go bam! You gotta go for it, yeah? What if you did a concussion? I will see that later. Okay, come on. <laughs> <You> ready, bro. <laughs> Three, two, one, go. No! Oh, oh, that was so close. <laughs> Woo! Woo! Mama, no! One go. No, but then you saw it. Just uh uh. Oh, you saw it. You're supposed to catch it with your head, but it doesn't fall off your head. But to see, you saw it. Just put the uh -huh. Uh -huh. check on credit. It, uh, it did what? It's just put the check on credit. What kind of shit is that? Oh, uh, I'm sorry. Nope, nope. <laughs> oh man, and I was really gonna buy you those shoes you wanted. <laughs> Why you always lying? Mm, oh my god. Stop getting lying. Okay, next brother. Come check. I'm gonna get me some Louis Vuitton shoes. You wanna get you what? Louis Vuitton shoes. Louis Vuitton? Yes. I've never heard of Louis Vuitton. Louis. Uh, Louis Vuitton. Okay, ready? Mr. Louis Vuitton. Three, two, one, go. talk about what is a man and what does it mean to be a man because Che always says let the man carry it I'm the man so Che how old are you first of all no actually first of all introduce yourself hi guys I was my name is Che and I was born on the 14th of January and I'm eight years old so today we're gonna be talking about a man okay Che so tell me what is a man? A man is someone that must always look after people and so a man must know, a man must never hit a woman or else that man is a coward. So men must be helpful, they must pray, they must go to church, uh, that's pretty much. 
So you always say you're a man. How are you a man? What do you do that makes you a man? Good question. I do not know. Bruh. I went to work with my dad on my holiday. Well, I could just be sitting in my room watching TV and relaxing. But I was getting bored so I just went to work with my dad. And every day when I come back from school, I always play outside. So, yeah. And I pray, I go to church. I wore a suit when I went to work. So that's what makes you a man? Yeah. And do you think you're a good man? Uh... I think... I think I'm 10% a man. 10% a man. And the rest? But I'm still a boy. I'm not a man yet. I just say I'm a man. But I'm a boy. Oh, okay. I don't know that. <laughs> okay, Chad. So, what is a good man? And what is a bad man? Good question. I think a good man is always helpful. A man that always prays, a man that always goes to church, a man that um, the, a man that doesn't hit a woman, and a man that is respectful, uh, a man that is uh, humble. Yes, that's the word. And a bad man is a man that will hit women. He won't pray, he won't go to church, he won't go to work, he will just sleep in his bed, he will always be rude, he will always abuse people, and he will always be moody. But sometimes you get moody, does that mean you're a bad man? <laughs> so let's say Ceci was going to get married, yeah. ne? What kind of man do you want Ceci to marry? Personally, that's not my choice. It's yours. But if I had to choose, it would be a black man. He would speak Tonga and he would speak very good English. And he should be respectful. He must be nice to my sister. If he, if he hits my sister, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to hit him back. If he hits me back, I'll take, I will fetch a bulb upstairs and hit him and run away. If he's very rude, then I don't know what to do. If he's rude, he's rude. Nothing I can do. End of story. Okay, so what kind of man do you not want Ceci to marry? I wouldn't want you to marry a man. Why? Because you're not the same religion. Oh, so you think Ceci mustn't marry someone who's not the same religion as her? Why not? Because you see, you can't go to the same church, you see. And then you, know, you guys will play differently, you see. Mm. You know, it was Father's Day. Right? What makes someone a father? I'm not sure. Yeah, maybe. I'm sure maybe he's single. Then maybe he, he just goes to a place and he finds someone that he likes and they like him back. Maybe they will start dating them. Maybe soon they will actually get married. Then they have kids. Then on the Father's Day, they celebrate. A good dad. There's a dad that spends his, his spends his money wisely. You know, he must he must he must not uh, spend his money on ridiculous stuff. He must buy the first thing. He must buy a house, then get married, then he can buy cars. Wait, first thing he must get a job, then he must buy a house, then he must get married, then he must 
buy a car, then he must budget, and he must have a bank account to save all his money. Do you have any questions for me? Yes. What? Is it so when they cut open your stomach? Bro, who cut? I've never got my stomach cut open. What if? Yes, yes, it is so. Don't they knock you out? Okay, like they... what is a good woman? This turns around. This is a this is a turn around in Uno. Now it's back to you. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> what is a good woman? <clears throat> yes. A good woman is a Proverbs thirty one woman. What? It's in the Bible. A good woman is a woman who respects herself, who respects God. Okay, who... okay, okay, okay. Let's move on. Really, nigga? Do you like being a woman? Do I like being a woman? Yes. Oh, <clears throat> okay. Uh, yeah, no. Yeah. Come on. Uh oh, oh, girl. Hell, oh, uh, yeah, it's nice. And being a woman is nice. I mean, there's nothing like, yeah, it's nice. Yeah, nice. But it's not easy. That's it for today, guys. I hope you liked this video. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe. You know, let's make sure this video gets um, maybe like 10,000 like Shout out to all the women and men together. Goodbye. Peace and love, guys. <laughs>